Hello and welcome to my fourth and final Torchwood review. Torchwood, I said Torchwood and I get Torchwood again. So yeah, today I am, well this time, I am reviewing Gwen. I'm surprised it doesn't say Gwen Cooper. So yeah, there is a picture of her. I'm sure you all know what she looks like anyway. Oh, this focus is going to be a pain again, I I am um, sense. So yeah, um, I will, this will be my last Torchwood review, but um, not the last review today. Uh, and the, the last one that will be today will be a very special review. So yeah, be looking forward to that. Um, so yeah, I will get her out of the package and review her. So, oh, sorry. Can we jolt it then? Oh, oh. So yeah, here is the Gwen Cooper action figure. Um, hold on, let me get it back on its stand. Her back on its stand, sorry. She's in high heels, so that's very hard to do. Um, but... Where is the hole? Uh, I just realised how sad that wrong that sound. Uh, anyway, <laughs> yeah, these reviews are getting over it. This should be over eighteen. Um, so yeah, cut to the chase. She comes with a torchwood stand. There, right. Forget that. Um, so yeah, ah, focused. Yeah, it does look a bit like Gwen. From the side, it does. From the back, it it does. So yeah, not a bad, not a bad figure detail-wise. Trying to look, it can't focus anywhere. I'd say eight out of ten because you know they aren't professional toy makers. So um, you got to give them some credit. Oh well, forget focusing. Um, so yeah, detail on the clothes. And she did come with a gun, but I've put that away and that was pretty cool. So yeah, detail on this figure. I'd probably give um eight at nine out of ten. Eight or nine out of ten for detail. Articulation, she does that kind of splits. Knee joints, elbow joints, spin back, no waist like the cyber woman. Head doesn't spin like like the others, so that's pretty bad. And then she does bend over and uh matrix style. So yeah, for articulation, probably eight because of the head. So yeah, it is a pretty good figure. Um, it is probably. I'd get it if I were. I yeah, if you're looking for a figure, this is probably a good one to get. Anyway, that was a pretty quick review, and now I'm going to finish it up. So yeah, um, this has been the last talk with the review. <laughs> Um, yeah, so I hope you've enjoyed all of them, and they will return when Wave 2 is out. But, um, judging by the way Wave, wave 1 went, yeah, it's out in May. Yes, it's December, and you've only just arrived in. But, um, so these are due out in May. So, the next reviews will be up next Boxing Day, probably. <laughs> if they're ever, if they actually, they best come out on time. Wave 2. So yeah, um, thank you for watching, I hope you've enjoyed all the reviews, and um, I hope you'll watch my next review, which is another Doctor Who one, and it's very special. So yeah, thank you for watching, take care, and goodbye. Oh, Merry Christmas too. A bit late. Bye!